two accomplished coaches will pit their masterminds against each other. Sa araw na ito, tip off brought to us by Honda. Ganda ng laro nito against Converge. Spins in the lane, short. J basket agad para kay Ju. JB in the lane, puts it up. That's good para kay Brownlee. Much tougher for him to score, especially with a taller interior defense by the Bay Area Dragons. But back-to-back -back baskets this time around. Lamb hitting nothing but the bottom of the net. Had to pick up his dribble. Goes all the way to the other side. Stan Pringle down to Aguilar. Butik na maagawan. May baseline si Malonzo. On the spin! Reverse para kay Jamie. Brownlee, a familiar sight running down the PBA court. Stan Pringle from three. That's good! 8-5 to five is the score. He Nebra's in the lead. Nicholson contra Brownlee. Nicholson, lefty hook shot goes! And Andrew Nicholson gets his first two points. Practically lying down, last second shot. So he impressed. And Nicholson, big shoes to fill. But he hits two in a row already. Andrew Nicholson strutting his stuff. Close to the basket and also as a decent perimeter jumper. Four straight points. Wow! Stabilizing their defense and holding their own against a young but very disciplined team. Team. As for Coach Gurgen, he spoke of Coach Tim's reputation, saying he's heard about him and everything he's done in the PBA. Adding, he's excited to play against Inebra. Uh, and, and just sumenyas lang siya. Tapos, uh, duck duck na agad, no? Scotty Thompson! Wow! Look at that! Power rebound from Scotty and the putback! Was an offensive rebound by Scotty Thompson and a putback against all defenders! Blankley sumubok! Oh! That was an amazing shot from Hayden Blankley! Close to 13 points per ball game and he knows exactly when it's the time for him to score. JB gets another basket. Simple, simple lang. Tinapik palabas yung ball. Duncan Reed already in there. There's the outside shot. Blankley and this guy Youngest player in the league. Finishing fast break situations for his team yet. Not yet. Oh, speaking of fast breaks, Stan Pringle stops and pops. You gotta remember, Powell is averaging more than 35 points per ball game. Can Nicholson do it? Big Liu nandyan sa ilalim. And let's see if mga drive po ito mga Hinebra players. But hey, there's the answer right there. Here's Lam. Blankly, three. Pasok na naman para kay Hayden Blankley. Blankley one more time. Now it's Lamb. He has a basket already. He wants another. And he gets it off the glass. That uh, he gets into the scoring parade early in the ball game. Nicholson from outside. And he had time to set and measure. Handling goes to Yang Samaikana. How quickly that ball goes to the other side. And then now inside. And there you go. Yun yung kanina na nullify. He gets his second dunk, but the first one that counts. Yang. Finger roll is good, and the Dragons seize the lead. Natapos ang first quarter natin. Two point lead for Bay Area. Tenorio leans in. Stan Hardinger to follow, and he gets on the board. 12 to 2 run for them to finish the first quarter. Nicholson, another three. Dominican University ni Jeremiah Gray, anong tawag sa team nila? The Penguins. Ah, ganun ba? Oh, Penguin yan. Pero there's a shot inside. Andrew Nicholson. Now Chapet, all these biblical names. And then, Yang picks it up. Three on two ito. They go to Nicholson. Da -dok -dok! Si Andrew. Scotty and then Malonso, Jeremiah Gray. And JB, of course, turn around. Jumper is good over Warren Yang as if the defense was not there. Loft it to Brownlee. Brownlee surveys the floor, sees a bunch of white shirts, attacks anyway and gets it There's under it. the defense of Zhu. Forced turnover, basket by Brownlee, he dribbled the length of the court, and Jory could like such a smooth layup from JB, but there was a quick retaliation from Zhu, which was unproductive. Wow, <laughs> Nicholson is just a tough cookie. Grabbed that ball away from two red shirts and then he just pump faked. Slammed it home, but Jamie Malonzo, bumawi naman, side jumper. Once upon a time, it's now trimmed down to just three. Glenn Yang, off target on the three, but Nicholson one more time. Duck, duck na naman! Keeps it alive, so may pagkakataon muli. They tried to go inside, not a pick. Pringle now, he sees Kobe Lamb. Oh, crossed him over, left it for Justin. He will jump it home with a great pass from Stan. Another highlight play, a fantastic assist pass by Stan Pringle to JB. But it's with Nicholson right now. 
Hook shot goes once again, and Nicholson is a point producer. Wouldn't he play close to 17 minutes and average close to eight points per ball game? So he's a legit ball player, I'm telling you. Justin Brownlee weaving his way through the white shirts. Leaves it for Jappet, flips it up, no go, but Scotty, the one-handed putback from the right side. Jude to Blankley, and that's blocked upstairs. Jamie Malonzo denying him. Now Brownlee, that's a three. Three team fouls apiece with 3.16 to go. So it's been a free-flowing game, more or less, Coach Ryan, and everybody's enjoying it. Yang this time had time to calibrate. So kung kailan siyang pinakamalit na import, dun pa siya na best import. Yes. Wow. wow. Scotty took it away. And then, alam mo, yung mga hustle plays ng Inebra have been resulting in basket. Kobe Lamb at the corner. Balik kay Blankley sa taas. Swing all the way to Ju. And then Nicholson. Easy basket. Tino mo kano ka. Dali. To foil or even to ch change the shot of the opponent. The bounce inside, Brownlee on the reverse. Great feed from C Stan to JB. Nicholson backing down Stan Hardinger, makes his move. Skyhook! Kareem Abdul Jabbar is in the building. Gagadra mga play, Daktakan 50 48, Ginebra at the turn. Pairaman, despite yung 26 ngani Nicholson, dikita dikita ngani laban down pasira ng dalawa. Brownlee finds another opening, just leans in. At uh, yung up and under move na yon, defying the defense of Blankley. Chalk up another two points for JB. Ito si Lamb. Jumper. Good para kay Kobe. Reed swings to Blankley, down to Nicholson. Nicholson thinking about how to operate against Stan Hardinger. He'll step back. Jumper is good! Are you kidding me? Wow. There was a double team that was supposed to come from the baseline. Highly efficient sa ating laban. Brownlee naman ang susubok. <laughs> oh! Mabandang tira na pailing si Justin Brown as he went down. Napapagod na. Oh, oh. Napapagod eh. And Brownlee umatake sapagkat wala nga big man na nandun sa ilalim. Offensive rebounds is also a big concern as they can't create second chance opportunities for their team. You know, we're talking about Nicholson and Brownlee bringing everything out. Hey, Jamie Malonzo, gusto rin magpakita. And even Zheng is in an attack mode. The first shot was a miss. Normally by this time they have seized the lead. Lamb to the hoop, gets it to go. Wala pang basket si Jeremiah. Alam mo, halos pareho ng uh, pedigree at pareho ng uh, look itong si uh, Gray at si uh, Malonzo. Wow, Scotty Thompson back-to-back -back block shots! Scotty saying, hey, I'm the MVP. Jeremiah, that's a three! Lamb, he was open, instead went to the other side. Hindi mapasok ni Zheng and then and then naman yung mga spectacular rebound from Scotty Thompson. He's got eight. And then Brownlee. Duck, duck sa kabila. But they look for some offense first. The ball is in their possession uh, because it's a Hinebra 12-point lead. Agawan! Thompson the fake. Pinalipad. Putting on a show. The MVP. On both ends of the basketball court. Off uh, defensively is oh, always yeah, making it yeah. available. Back-to-back -back steals. Yes, for Pananga Hinebra. And the leading score nila na si uh, Brownlee with a total of 36 points already. Nako na ipit sa ilalim, but the big boy is there para ibalik yon. And chip away because this is still a 14-point disadvantage that they're trying uh, to overhaul. Kobe Lamb to the hoop one more time, and he's shown the ability to break down defenders. Pero nakita mo yung mga adjustments agad. Tira mo, di ba yung hustle? They know they just have to bring up their level of intensity. Eh. Lamb. And they put it in, it was see Liu on that putback. And Bay Area Dragons really tightening their defense, forcing turnovers, and let's see this once again. Well run play. That will be reviewed. Zheng, quick pass to Nicholson. Nicholson's been quiet. This time, it won't fall, but then the big guy, you know, this guy is keeping them closer. But if you ask me, again, you posted this question at the start of the third quarter, how can Baragay Hinebra generate a bigger lead. The first thing that I said was to guard Nicholson. And so far, so good for Barangay Hinebra. LA Tenorio's back in the game. Lamb will attack one more time. Quick to the hoop talaga ito si Kobe Lamb. Otherwise, just take the shot because you've got two big guys for a possible offensive rebound. Tama. Gray. 
Off target on jumper, pero chop it naman! It's just falling straight into the hands of the Hinebra player. Six seconds to shoot. We're under a minute to go, about 47 seconds actually in the period. JB fading. That's Justin Brownlee. For Barangay, this is such a brilliant three quarters for them. They are just no longer the best fast-breaking team in the league. And Sandy Pringle, wow. Drivers cannot make baskets on the move. Another challenge shot. It was obviously contested once again. And the elegant shot. L.A. Tenorio, his first basket in the ball game. Uh... And the thing is, Jibo, magreklamo pa sana si Glenn Yang to say na, Oh! Parang ali yung pipay nangyari dun eh, no? It's been tough for him offensively. Ewing. Scotty Ewing! 5'9 guard. Puts that one in. Ginebra's performance, parang talagang, you know, they know they're defending home court. Diba? Led by this guy. Parang naghahanap na rin ng magandang kombinasyon si Coach Gurjin dahil hindi na makita yung advantage na meron siya. Some different combinations. Kung mag-click, why not? That's a three. And finally, he breaks the missing streak from Rainbow Country. So they're now two out of 19 yes, easily yes. in their last 19 attempts. Now in the third, in the fourth and final quarter, 13 to 6 na naman. He'll make it uh, 15 to 6 run for Barangay in Ebra. So I don't know if they're aware of it as Glenn Yang gets a layup. <laughs> Daming puntos na 46 na yan eh. Second three para kay Yang. Defense just to make the paint a little more slug for him to operate. And offensively, they used their familiarity with one another. Na naging problema naman itong Bay Area Dragons. Ni JB. At that is not done yet. For Barangay Hinebra, itong si Malonzo in this game. Clean look. Dahil wala nga nagpe-penetrate na wala ng creator itong team ng Bay Area Dragons. So, weak reply. Dunk, even Duncan Reed. Only his first two points in the ballgame. The most consistent Bay, Bay Area Dragons is Yu Song Wei. Tama. Diba? Jumper in the first half. Ang ganda ng turn niya to start the scoring. At nag-announce na nga ng last two minutes. Even as Scotty Ewing wants to take another one, he's making a second one. But a long way to go in this conference. Maha, Papa. This is uh, only the third game for Barangay Hinebre ng uh, ma malakas na kupunan. And uh, I say this because yung first four games nila, yun ang mga teams na, for example, the first game against uh, yung bossing. And the second game was against uh, Northport. They barely won against Northport. Only a uh, basket because of that buzzer beater by Powell. 106 against 100. Victory against Converge. Pero dito sa Barangay Hinebra, talaga hindi nila alam kung paano didipensa. Sino ba hindi nakascore sa Hinebra? I think Raymond Aguilar has, hasn't scored. Uh, Von Pesomal hits a three. Kinailangan talaga na makakuha rin siya ng kumpiyansa dahil uh, there's a reason why they brought him over here. That's our final score, 111.93. That's brought to us by Honda, the official motorcycle of the PBA.